place today one of my um, big bucket list destinations and probably most of yours um, if you've never heard of it you need to it's called the US Virgin Islands and so far it's beautiful so we're gonna go grab some breakfast at 7 a.m. we're here from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. 12 hours all day grab some breakfast and then we're gonna go explore and hit the beach Hey guys, thanks for watching today's video. If you want to see more from us, make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel. Our daily breakfast place. <laughs> so this is picture-worthy breakfast. We have a nice buffet breakfast with this view. Make sure to follow our social media accounts where we'll be posting more content related to this YouTube channel. That should be my next job. I'm moving to the Virgin Islands. That's my calling. The Little Mermaid. Danish. No, we're not gonna stop until we reach it. All you need to know is that we're holding on. We rise up from the dust and clean my throat. You know you've been eating too much on the cruise. When every picture, I'm like, <laughs> I'm half asleep. So I'm already having really fun, good vibes. I'm really enjoying this cruise life, even though it's exhausting because it's so much fun, but um, it's a good reason to be exhausted. All the people are like so happy and fun and it's just a really good mood, um, good atmosphere. So cruise life I think is for us. It's so interesting for me to see the American flag everywhere here because it's so, here in Puerto Rico, Virgin Islands, it doesn't feel like it's really like American, so to say, culture, but it is American owned, so it's just, I don't know, it's kind of cool, interesting. But uh, right now we're just walking, we just left the port, or we're walking like through the port, we left the boat, and there's a lot of shops, um, souvenirs, so we're doing that right now, and we're gonna head to downtown and then the beach. Standing up, everybody's gonna see it. Oh, all you need to know is that we're holding on, even if we fall, we will rise up and we follow the path that we will Pharmacy, which is an American brand. So, again, interesting to see the American companies, American influence they have here in the islands in the Caribbean. I just want to show that Amor is already getting. 
getting in trouble. No. He got yelled at for jumping in the middle of the street there. <laughs> I guess somebody got... Thank you. Somebody got hit there this morning. So Amor is running across the street and he's getting yelled at. <laughs> we just got off the boat and he's already... Our ship is there. We've walked five minutes and he's already getting yelled at. Already in trouble. <laughs> so we have all these beautiful places on the island of Virgin Islands and Amor chooses to go into the Wendy's. No, he's got to use the bathroom. <laughs> Calling you out. What a Wendy's looks like in the Virgin Islands. So I also see they have rainbow here as well. If you can remember in Puerto Rico, they had rainbow, which is an American owned company we have in the US. So another American, uh, Americanized influence here in the Virgin Islands. So just a quick little update slash review. It's been like the first 10 minutes since we got off the ship here in the US Virgin Islands. And so far, I'm really liking it. The people are super nice. We talked to a bunch of locals and they're not pushy. They are offering stuff on the street like tours, but they're not like pushy about it. They're super easy going and cool. And um, it's beautiful. Anything else? First impression? Relax. Amazing, relaxed, good vibes, good energy, cool, nice people. Um, and in the Wendy's, I made new friends. <laughs> the locals, they're really nice working there. So shout out to my girl. <laughs> Don't know your name, but hey, you see this? Hello. We walked into this little yacht haven shops is the name and this is where you see Gucci, Louis Vuitton, lots of yachts, White House Black Market, so lots of expensive shopping. It's again very windy day. I guess that's the island life. So let's take a look. So that looks like a fun place, the Fat Turtle. It's not open yet, it's still very early, it's like 9 a.m. There's our cruise ship. Some yachts. Milk and Honey, I like that name actually. Look at the big American flag. It looks like this is gonna turn into a nice little hangout fun spot. Shopping, Avida. I know all these brands. So a lot of little salons in here. Louis Vuitton. Gucci is somewhere around here. It's beautiful. It's a nice area. Just got invited to go sailing, but we politely declined because we're headed to the beach. I have to explore the downtown a little bit first. Look, there's our cruise ship. Wow, it's beautiful here. So peaceful. Washed up, don't want to believe it. I guess the thing here is like there's free ranging, roaming chickens everywhere on the island. Like way too many, we were way too many, not money, and way too many. We were told by a local um, that had two dogs and their dogs. Basically, she was walking her dogs, and she said it's a constant battle every day. Her dogs trying to um, fight and capture and maybe possibly even eat chickens. So I think you're gonna notice that as we go around the island that there's just chickens everywhere. Everywhere you turn, let's go chicken hunting. We're not hunting, but chicken searching. There they go. Those look like little baby chickens. I've seen some bigger ones than that. Take it or leave. 